Good Friday morning, loves. Um, I'm here to do a um, somewhat of a confirmation reading on Simon Quentin. Uh, when Simon Quentin went missing, um, there was others that was saying that he would be found in a couple of days and somebody would be charged. Um, and when I did his reading, I did not pick up that he would be found right away and that somebody would be charged right away. I told y'all that um, it would take somebody to say something to know the location of this child. Uh, and that's exactly what it took. Um, it's been what, eight days, seven, eight days that this baby's been missing. Um, they believe they have a location on him, but that information came through somebody. I told y'all they just wasn't going to search and run up on him and find him that way. That they were going to have to have information come through somewhere, somehow, in order to know where the baby was. And um, that's exactly what has happened. Um, they have not charged the mother as of yet. Um, I'm sure that's going to come soon. Um, I think they are waiting on the child because of the way the information was given to them that they... Um, got the location on the child, so they want to find the child just to find out exactly um, how he passed so they can get the best charges they can on her, okay? Um, <clears throat> different charges are different sentencings, okay? So they don't just want to come in and get manslaughter and give her what, 20 years, you know, so they, they really need Quentin, um, I pray that they do get him today, I pray they find him today, um, I'm not real hopeful on that, uh, just to be honest that it will be today, um, but like I said, I just wanted to confirm that, you know, he was not found in a couple of days, um, nobody has been charged yet, and it did take somebody to come through in order for them to get a location on this child. And right now the location is allegedly because they still have not found him yet. So we'll, we will have to sit and wait on the rest of it. Um, <clears throat> I know y'all don't like it when I say, uh, When I say pray for the family, but regardless of what, you know, we still need to pray, you know, we still need to pray regardless. So I, I'm going to always say that in every case, um, just because I believe in my God and he tells me that's what I'm supposed to do. He tells me that he'll do the rest. He also tells me that if I pray on somebody else's demise, their karma won't come back to them. It will come back to me. So you pray for them. If you know anything about your Bible, you know the Bible says that. Now, um, not in those exact words, but that's exactly what he tells us. Not to pray for somebody to get karma on them for something bad they did. Not to pray mean things towards somebody because you want payback or judgment on them. Because then it won't happen. And it may come back to you. So, um, just pray good thoughts. Um, try to hold your peace. Try not to feed your demons. Um, you know, justice is coming for this child. It's just slow. It's slow, but it's coming for this child. And, uh, like I said, you know, for all of, uh, I've seen people, um, pray for the downfall on this mother. Oh, I pray that God gives you the foolish judgment. Read your Bible because obviously 
you believe in God, you believe in Jesus, or you wouldn't have made that comment. Obviously, you don't read your Bible and you don't know what your Bible says. Or you're just spitting things out and you don't believe in your Bible. He tells us not to pray that way on anybody, no matter what they've done. Because they will not get the judgment that is due to them if you do that. I will find that uh, Bible scripture later on and, and come back and post it because I'm sure I'm going to have some people, you know, who is going to counter react that or whatever. And, you know, I'm really not going to care, but I will prove to you that the Bible does say that. Okay? Um, but like I said, I just come on here to confirm that um, <clears throat> when I did his reading that he would not be found in one or two days. It was going to be a process and somebody, somebody, something was going to have to let them know where that child was in order for them to find that child. Okay? Um, and that's exactly what has happened. They have got some information. And that was the only way they was going to find that child. And I told y'all that in um, both of his readings. Um, but just calm down. Slow down. It's a slow process for Quentin. It's a slow process for this baby. But um, he will get justice. As long as we do right. He will get justice. Okay? Peace, love, and light to you guys. And I will be back later. I'm going to do a couple of readings. Hopefully, they will be uplifting readings. And um, we could get in touch with some um, good energies that is out there that will put out some uh, good karma for Friday night. Let's see what Friday night holds for y'all. Okay, so I'll be back later. Peace, love, and light, guys.